Mitch and James and Eric was like footballing in the even in the facility. <laughs> yeah. And I think that's because of the that trig Dallas Cowboys triggered them to play football in this area, I guess, because it's Texas. No. Shout out to the GOAT Tom Brady, I guess. <laughs> We flew in last Saturday, three or four days ago, and uh, Nathan flies in next Saturday. So me and Eric are going to be here for about three weeks, and uh, Nathan will be here for two weeks. We're excited to have the full team together for the first time. And now everything is different. The whole roster is different, and we have different roles now that Vanny has joined the team. And this roster has been like the most promising so far. We also get to meet one lead for the first time. I've never been yeah. more excited for something. That's all. We're going to meet a uh, legendary one leaf here today. <laughs> I'm so looking forward to see. That's good. That's really interesting about the, like leaf. Sometimes like I feel like he's like, really older than me, like personality or like something like emotion. I don't know. <laughs> it's hard to explain. So yeah. One, wait, Eric. <laughs> camera. Hey, three. Which camera? Oh, three, two, one. I mean, I think we're all pretty similar out of game. Like, I think we're all pretty big. Like, none of us take ourselves too seriously. We just like to joke around. I think uh, I'm probably the most serious, and I'm also pretty stupid at the same time. So it's kind of confusing. And our team is kind of similar to what it was on Chaos, like personality-wise. Like, we have someone who doesn't speak native English, but he's just he just makes people laugh all the time. <laughs> Zeta's is kind of like a curious cat because he's really gullible and he just really is just funny on accident, you know? Curious guy. Do you know what that means? <laughs> no. For me, yeah, I had to I adjust to everything because everything is new for me, but as time goes by, it'll be fine. Take my shirt. And my gray. It's me and Sunny. <laughs> Who's the bigger one? Who's the bigger one? Probably me. <laughs> For now, like I'm, start, I'm trying to like uh, absorbing everything that makes me a better player. Or like, if I have a, if I can see the advantages from it, I'm just like don't mind too like. We scrim a little. We start a little earlier, and we also work out before our practice now. Something I didn't personally do before when on chaos. And now, uh, I mean, every day um, we wake up around 9.55, we go work out, and then we come back and play scrims. I definitely think living a healthy lifestyle is pretty important. I think more so just like the physical activity. It doesn't need to be like going to the gym or anything. It's just doing like some form of physical activity. And I think uh, doing it consistently is more important than like the one-off like workout here and there though. Sony, where'd you get this drip from? Where'd you get the drip from? Yeah. You, you, you told me. <laughs> I told you? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> you told me to find you send the eyeball and Wait, the those YouTube shoes are nice though. Those are Puma? Yeah. You told me to buy this. Yeah. You don't remember? <laughs> no. You, you just literally... I said I like You look better than Mitch. That's yeah. okay. Oh. Yeah, true. <laughs> oh, oh, there we go. There we go. Who's the J. Cole, by the way? Forever. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, you got coffee? Yeah, that's my blue. No, not yet. Okay, I got a coffee. Okay, good. Yeah, good. <laughs> do anything. We're waiting on food, guys. Okay. <laughs> what did you do? I didn't do anything. I saw you freak out. What happened? I don't know. Your mom? What happened? Dark Horse? Damn. 
That's the agent name. Yo, yo, Nate, 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 Nate. What? It's a, it's the same head in the, on the stage. The same head. Dude, I'm telling yeah. you, that's a new agent. Then I want you guys to just give me some a fun animated face. Nothing too serious, but just give me some quick, alright? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, right there. One, two, three, and bam. That's exactly it. Looking at it, Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, That's the hoodie. world, yeah, world hoodie. Can I cop this? <laughs> no. <laughs> what size is of this? Looks cool. Is it your size? No. Is it medium or is it? No, it's a 3XL. Oh, okay. oh, hell no. <laughs> Sonny, aim! Sonny! Sonny, oh, go home. Korea? No. Sonny, go Sonny, get your PC. Go get your PC. Also, um, the other option is um, they're trying to cancel today. What? The tournament delayed to like two days later after, and then figure out what should do. They they might just make the whole show. thing online at the gaming house. Like send everyone back to their gaming house and then do it, make it online. That's another option they're considering. Look how deep yours goes though. Oh, like this one? Yeah. The part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, I think mine is abnormal. I think so. Abnormal? Yeah, abnormal. Yeah, because that's weird. Okay, nah, Sonny's just different. Yeah, Never I'm mind. Different, right? <laughs> Holy. I'm built different. Wait, dude. Built <laughs> different. It's so long. Day one, I think uh, day one is pretty clean. Not gonna lie. Did you forget anything? Nope. nope. Day one was good? Day one was good. Let's go. So I woke up, 6 a.m., did an Ironman oh, athlete yeah. triathlon. Oh, legend. Thank uh, you. Came here, got something stuck up my nose. I'm negative. Someone else is positive. Day's canceled. Day ruined. It is what it is. Hopefully we can play online. You got Someone from another team. Someone from another team is positive. And um, it's over. I'm going to start crying. The plan was to do COVID tests, play the tournament after we wait for fucking phase rise. Why are you swearing? Sorry. Play V1. Don't know when. Never will know when. We may end up playing in our underwear at home. We don't know. We got real three point lines now. Yeah, I think it's really important to stay active. Uh, usually when we're back at the team house, we do morning workouts. Um, but since we're at the hotel and we're at a tournament and there's the COVID concerns, we have to be a little more creative. So we found a park where there's nobody here. We're playing horse. Uh, we also brought a, a football with us to toss around. So I think it's really important to stay active and so do the guys for the mental acuity. James, teach me how to grip. All right, look, uh, teach you. What? So there's laces on, on a real? normal ball. Middle finger on the first one. Okay. Basically like that, basically. Have the this finger like on the tip. But, um, and when you throw it, you uh, want to basically flick out of your hand. Is, your fingers. You know, no, my situation stays the same. There you go. Oh, like this? Yeah, there you go. Oh, no, that's not, that's not. Yeah, better. You guys are more of a like straightforward, but mine is like, Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Un said um, we're gonna go compete in Europe, and after that, we're going to win the last chance qualifier there, and then we're gonna go to the APAC region, Asia Pacific, win that one, and we're gonna have multiple spots. 
And then we'll come back to NA after we win both of those, and then we'll have three spots in Champions for Cloud9. Events canceled, we're going to Texas to play online or something like that. Or we're trying to go to Texas. Do we have dates or anything or no? Nope. Two, two weeks, roughly. I, I had uh, no opportunity to go to Texas, but I can go to Texas now. So. Oh, no! This is content. Feeling better than I ever been. Cairo in his bag, this beat is heaven sin. Back up in my element. New whip, trunk up in the front. I whip an elephant. It's all limo tent. That's how you move when you the president. We're in Frisco, Texas at the Complexity GameStop Performance Center and uh, boot camping for LCQ. I'm dead. It's not my fault, bro. Think you could win a game without backing once? What? That's kind of... On Yumi, you could. <laughs> Dude, this is the dumbest thing I've ever seen, man. <laughs> like, what is this? <laughs> I don't even have to play the game. What do you think of your teammates' uh, League of Legends skills? Nice brain, brain grinding. I respect the character. <laughs> League requires brain, so I don't care. <laughs> League requires brain. I play Yumi. <laughs> Should you just I said it, man. Listen, I'm, I'm shooting people. <laughs> no, you're not. Compared to um, LA, Texas is like weather is really uh, different compared to like LA. It's like sometimes windy as hell, sometimes uh, like rainy. Like I didn't see this like too much in LA. I definitely think uh, we're most excited to actually finally get a play. It's our first like real official with this team. I mean, I guess we played an NSG tournament, but we won the NSG tournament without really any practice. Like I think we had like two days. I think I think you had one day with Leaf on Jet and Mitch on Sentinel, but we had like two days with Mitch where he was on Jet. But uh, I don't know. I think we've made a lot of progress, and we're excited to play the LCQ. <laughs> no, I'm stuck with Pufo. <laughs> Who do you think I am? I'm Korean. I'm stuck with Pufo. That's Pufo. Football with football. Who's my... Today we'll be playing version one, my old Ooh, team. Shit. Could you imagine the sweet, sweet taste of victory for V1 if they were able to take down what are being considered like the behemoths? Now in Cloud9, that would be nuts. Wait, no, is well. Leaf spot's been given away. But do they oh, still off of that? Where's the swing? It doesn't matter. Leaf's good for one. Leaf's good for two. <laughs> Leaf's good for three, baby. Spike ticking away. Version one are gonna have to... Yeah, yeah, what, what the, what the fuck? fuck are you doing? Getting guns, getting guns. See, exactly what Bandit, 40, 40. Sorry. It might have hurt you. Yeah. him out. Leaf with 4 HP. Do you have the heroics against Whippy here? Tap. Whippy. Oh! 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 Wrong time. Okay, guys, the showstopper comes online as Elsis is hunting. Oh! oh! The shot. Wiz is right by his ear. But that's all it is. Mitch able to get two on the spike. Mitch, bro, did you see me with the fucking raise? Oh, I just jumped over it. Oh my god. Zelsis can really go hunting if he wants to, but Tapa's good for one. Bandit gets one as well. Nice. Reload in, reload in. Nice. Come on! Yo, you ain't still skinny here, guys. Come, 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 come. Take this, take this. The wall is still up. The Hunter Fury's gonna come out as well. Out from Epi's with 15 health, and guess what? Bandit is on the lurk again, but is he even gonna get a chance? His teammates might be Stay left, stay left, stay left. I'm playing with him. Yeah, kid, kid, you. Anthony was what? 0 and 8 at one point? 0 and 9. 0 and 9. 0 and 9. Alright, 0 and 9. Um, honestly, we're making fun of him every single round, and that's probably why, you know, he just started to step up. up and, you know, gotten up and started shooting people. But, I mean, we had, we had no worries, guys. Like, we pressed tab, we know who's on the other team, and that's about it. Yeah. After V1, we went on to play Rise. First map, Breeze went into overtime. And after the second overtime, Superman lagged out for the whole entire night, uh, like a power outage storm in Iowa or wherever he lives. So we had to reschedule for the next day and proceeded to play one round on Breeze and then lose it uh, to lose the map. Rise looking to capitalize here on map number one, Neptune with two, Neptune with a third, and that's gonna solidify it, Vans, we're in. And we're out just as fast for the end of this one as Rise are able to keep the momentum going throughout the night. And we played Ascent and we were down 6-0 and came back and won 14-12, I'm pretty sure. And then on Haven, we just got completely like outplayed and lost 13-4. Of course. That's bad. That, that was embarrassing. We just don't listen to each other. It's fucking stupid. 
I hope, uh, I wish we can meet the rice at the end again for the story because imagine if we run lower like brackets without any delaying or like the cancel things or something like that, that's gonna be a good story. Aggressively flashing, aggressively swinging. Oh! Into the corner attempt gets two! Mitch gets the last one, gets the second one as well. 1v1 as well. The remains 40 seconds. Mitch, let's go! The Red Bull clutch for Cloud9! It's a heavy stack that way. Vanity's he's about to have his hands full. He's got two. Yep, it's got me too. Go help, go help, go help. Side, 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 side. Nice. I'm not last. Nice. nice. Mitch has to go in aggressive to clear it out. GMD cleans it. Vanity's gonna fall as well. Vanity leaves. Oh my gosh, it's all down to Temp. Cloud9 send GMG packing and live to fight another day. Zeta down to 43. Zeta low HP on the other players. Pure is down. Did it go down to half? I don't think it did, and it doesn't matter! No flank being contemplated, so Vanity's a world away. Not finding value, but the boost it does. BCJ getting pressured. Zappa's gonna be able to get another one, make it a third! Uses it out. One grab well goes in. Boost up from Leaf. Oh! Death goes down! 1v4 for BCJ! Wide swings out into double coverage! Cloud9! We'll see you in Losers Finals! Here comes the plant that's going to be called the rotation fully coming in now. Zeta ready with a no one. It is on the other side, Astra. Oh my god, what? Vanity. This round is coming down to the utility and frags because so far Cloud9 has read the play like oh. Zeta with a great sonar bolt there. How much can Cloud9 use this? Ethan and Hiko trying to make it a null effect. No, sir. Nice. Coming out, coming out, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. 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 Left side, back side, back side. Come in, come in, come in. Boy comes up with a big frag. It's up to him, the newest member of the team. Can he keep this series? Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. That's going to be the defuse. There's more than enough time. Cloud9 lock in grand finals. They'll face Raze to get revenge. I think uh, us falling into the lower bracket was pretty big for us. I think us getting more match experience helped us get out a lot of like the little kinks that we were having, like the issues that we were running into in our um, first. I mean, our match against B1, we didn't really have very many, but our match against Rise, obviously, we had a lot of shortcomings and things that we typically don't do. First map against Rise today in the BO5 was Breeze. It's pretty. It was, it was pretty easy. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, I think that's our best map. And everybody gets over by brick for now and shop a little Spike bit. Spike still committed though. Uh, Superman. Superman, do you have enough help? What? Rise down. Superman eight. out. No man's land. And Zeppa says thank you very much with two clean shots to start this one. Oh my Both duelists. Both jets. Oh, the sucks. barrel sticks out. <gasps> Sorry, you're in the Fuck the mid. Nice. So okay. nervous. Bolted two. Bolted two. <laughs> Sunny. What happened? Uh, what happened on split, Sunny? I just like play the bridge perfectly, I guess, and, and throw the <laughs> Korean bridge. This this donkeys, this donkeys <laughs> never believes me. This donkeys like a, in scream like you, you. This guy's not cannot play bridge or whatever. But I I proved it, I guess. So yeah, I have pretty confident. So and then I we proved it as a team. So we won. Off your feet. Hitting most of sight. That Superman just stepping outside gets a good frag, and Zeppa will return. To oh, 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 oh. Sick. Nice! Come on! Let's go! Oh, man. Yo, Korea Breach pants! They cannot win! Holy fuck! <laughs> Our only common pistol round was don't let poise get a kill. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we had to finish the 0 and 13. Just hard defaulting. <laughs> I think they're gonna push. Let's just go slow. Let's try to make poise go 0 and 13. <laughs> okay. That's our main goal. Yeah, we just sat in our spawn and then I think we killed him with a raise nade and an Astra suck. Oh. It's gonna be B. Rise has such a neat setup for having an A, but it's not gonna help. We are going to lose a few. Nade to the backside. Zeppa starts off with, is it going to be a 13-0 to bring us to bind? Rope CT, less two. Rope CT, less two. Wait, I made noise. One enemy nice. remaining. Enjoy. Flawless. Nice, nice. Zero. Zero kills. <laughs> I, I, needed, I needed that guy backside. 
bind. What happened on bind, dude? Oh, you had like man. 30 kills. I don't know about my teammates, but I felt like we were winning no matter what was going to happen that map. <laughs> I'm going mean, to be honest, I after was, that 13-0, we won, dude, it yeah, was over. I mean, yeah, basically after we 13 0 them on uh, split, I mean, I think we all knew we were going to win this map no matter how it went. Wait, I'm TPing. Nice. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. We won SQ today. I'm excited to meet Face against the Pigeon Strikers because they're Koreans, so you know what I mean. So I can <laughs> so finally yeah. meet. You reunite like this donkey is Chaos 9. Oh, I can also reunite with the FPPK guys. Are we there yet? How long do we have left? Dude. How long till we get there? Bro. Are we there yet? Dude, so if you ask me one more time, I'm gonna lose it. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is your captain speaking. We're now approaching our destination. The weather in Berlin is currently cloudy. So when we first got here back in November, like around November 20th, we had to quarantine for about five days. After that, we started practicing on like the fifth or sixth day. We were able to scrim almost every team at uh, Champions. Personally, uh, I think scrimming every team is the same except for Gambit. Gambit is like the clear like you know team that was actually good and like. I just felt like, I mean, obviously, like, the screen we were, t or we were scrimming in any, like, BBG Renegades, obviously, like, they're a little worse than the teams we're scrimming are now. But I think Gambit was, like, the only clear uh, team that, like, you know, like, they're actually good. I think every other team is, like, we know in our minds that we can easily beat all the time. So, not really, besides Gambit. Yeah, we got to keep our mask on at all times. We either stay in our rooms or we're in the practice room until we're cleared to do other things, I guess. Hopefully that's tomorrow. Um, we have to do a COVID test at like 11 a.m. or somewhere on there. And we got scrims like later in the day to try and get our schedules right for the match time at 9 p.m. Uh, a week, a week until match time. Uh, playing against Fnatic. Some kind of waffle with Nutella. <laughs> what is this? What'd you get, Sonny? Uh, it's a Wiener Schnitzel. It's called. It looks like pork cutlet. German style pork cutlet, I guess. It looks tasty. So we got out of quarantine and we had about, I would say like two days to do whatever we wanted. We could go anywhere, go out to eat, whatever. And then uh, Rai came down with the hammer saying we couldn't leave our rooms anymore. And uh, we had to stay in the PRAC room or, or stay in our own rooms uh, for basically the rest of the trip because Germany was uh, rampant with COVID. Uh, the gift from Lyot. I think it looks so cool. It's like gold chain, shining.
studio in the middle of nowhere doing content for Riot. Good shit. It was better last time because we were in like an abandoned factory and I tried to get lost. Can't get lost here. Nah, it's just a factory. It's just like a warehouse. Can't get lost. Factory, you can get lost. Which one was your favorite? Sage, I think, because there's like grass. Okay. Haven't touched that in a while. You're like, wait, I'm, I'm going the, first? I'm the first one walking on. Unlucky. Better start. So why do you want to eat? Yeah. Front you eat? I don't know. But I'll be the first time. one in the in the fist bumps when we win. So We have a such talented coach. Sheesh. Insane. Bexa can play chess. He can sing. He can play piano. He can coach. He can play game. Wow. <laughs> I can only shoot the dart. I can only shoot the dart, you know what I mean? <laughs> So our third matchup is back to Group D, where we see Fnatic versus Cloud9, and this is actually going to be the match that a lot of people have been waiting for here for day one. Viva Boaster and Vanity in the media day were kind of going back and forth. These two are ready. Is it comes vanity left alone though in a 1v3 gotta have eyes on the back of your head as well that does not feel good six armor 63 hp he's still trying to make magic happen oh, the snake by all of the damage is just way too much for him to handle by himself but Toma's gonna stick it he's gonna stick it he's gonna take it all the way again how many times has that been changing the outcome of this map with magnum magnum gets two Vanity's left alone, and how much do you have in you? Not a ton. Fnatic get to map point. This map has delivered in every way possible. In every way possible. You're absolutely right. That was one of the better games that I've seen for Fnatic in a long... I've needed a week since round four, and I just couldn't <laughs> find a moment to go. I couldn't move away from that. But also, like, that wasn't a bad showing from Cloud9 Blue at all. To have swings around, but Zeta stops it just in the nick of time. Cloud9 do not give up a single inch. <laughs> Sonny's fucking drunk. They're, they're coming back. I don't even think they made any noise. Sonny, do you have soju in there? <laughs> <laughs>
What? Which one is it? I don't remember. Uh, uh, it was close to the end. When there are two ramp. It was like 10, 10 11. Like one ropes, one ramp. One ropes, one It was like 10, 11, I think. 10, 11. Yo. Oh, yeah, it didn't sound like a beat. No, 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 we're we're out here. I was like no. in the yo, 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 come here, come here. We're missing one. Trying to spam through, but Doma's just gonna stick the defuse. It doesn't matter. Fnatic gets a 12. Cloud9, still early in the tournament, but right find there. themselves down, down in a big way. Oh, if he's not gonna get the chance to do anything about it, I don't know that he's gonna have enough time for it either. Leaf cleans it up. Map three, fracture and overtime. Urka goes all the way in. He's able to take care of Mitch. Doma does as well as this. Oh, Leaf down to one. It's just oh, Leaf. Leaf has it and he's not able to do it. Fnatic's going to get the defuse. The first round of this EU versus NA matchup goes in favor of the Europeans on their home ground. Red back last night mentioned offhandedly that he wished he could have played Jet, and I had no idea about that, so that's my fault. So I think we should have like just like a relaxed little powwow right before each map to make sure any opinions we have like that are voiced. So let's remember that. The James, what James brought up, what he wanted to play Jet is because um, the reason why is because uh, he wanted to play on a little bit more fast tempo, and I think that's a good idea. And, and let's talk about like what composition we can use to enable him to do that. But for me, like uh, obviously having not played with you guys that much and just coming in from this as like a third pair of eyes, just seeing things fresh, um, I feel like there could be better communication between the players and the coaching staff. Um, for example, like I was, we were in a car driving back with Nate yesterday, and the feedback he was giving about stuff like, uh, you know, wanting to play Jet on Fracture or having the solutions in game but not listening to each other or certain other things. I think it's easy to make analyses and come away with it with some cold objective like this is what we should have done, this is how we counter their default, this is how we counter a comp. But um, I feel like on the day there's things that we aren't preparing for as much, and this is on me as well and James. I personally think nine out of ten times we play Fnatic again, we'll beat them. It's like the same thing as Riot, dude. Yeah, I think we're just overthinking it. Like, I was just telling James that I feel like we should have won Fracture. We and if we played it next time against them, we would have won. Yeah. It's yeah. our first Fracture match, and these guys literally have like two months worth of gimmicks. Like, every <laughs> single round that they did was a gimmick on defense. Yeah. I'm just too dangerous, I'm dangerous Let's be honest, say no contest Take those comments and form my concept From the get-go, I just get so dangerous, so dangerous Yeah, two equal sides, don't equal ties Yo, I came to equalize, let's energize Basic math plus minus equals times Pop says crazy watching the sequel shine Last man standing, tell him I seek my prize Challenge on why, stepping to bring you down like to be you guys letting people take all the truth and feed you lies as soon as you think that you safe MB Ascend MB. Let's go. Huh? Ascend MB. I really want to watch this. Ascend. If they MB beat Ascend, what would happen? We have a daybreak, right? Yeah. Because our match got yeah. yeah. Matches are, are, and I was like, yeah, I think it's probably like a 13-6, 13-6 if, if we play at 6 p.m. instead of midnight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this shit. I just hate the fact that 
We have to wake up so early, even though our yeah. match is so fucking late, dude. Like PCR test shit? Yeah, yeah, yeah true it's that. Really bad. True that. It ruined our sleep schedule. <laughs> well, I went to sleep like at four because I'm like the day before <laughs> we're like, recording. And imagine we got four even positive. sleep schedule. It's energy level. It's yeah, it's energy. Right? Right? Like it's yeah. just fucking well, I went terrible. To four, yeah, I went to sleep at four because the day before we're quarantined. I'm like sleeping all day. Are we at the wrong? I can't sleep. I feel like. Asked me a question in the features thing about vision strikers, and I said like. They asked me their biggest weakness, and I said readability and adaptability. Yeah, uh -huh. nice. And then they were like, "You have any message for them?" And I said, "Zed is Zed is the only good Korean or something." <laughs> oh no shit, way. Nate! Oh, shit. So now we have to win, or else I look like shit. Thanks, <laughs> thanks, Nate. You got me, right, Sonny? <laughs> thanks. Good fucking <laughs> shit. Called Vision Frackers. Yeah, I'm also a, a Korean. So Korean is Korean. The Korean gonna win. You see the nation's tweet? Yeah. <laughs> That's actually alpha. Is this uh, one of the teams you wanted to play? Yep. Whoever wins, first Korean. <laughs> Today is, uh, today is Arby's birthday. I can make him like a nightmare. Birthday, I yeah, I can make him night nightmare day. You can scream a happy birthday when, when we win. Just scream happy birthday. <laughs> so, yeah, oh weird. my fucking god, that's actually a nice idea. Nice idea. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Sonny, what is it? Happy birthday in Korean. Sengil chukai. Seng chu, seng chu and seng you. Seng chu il, chu a ke, chu. Then you got the low right. I can't do it. This beautiful, nice work from Cloud9. It's King and RB to try and do something about it. And Mitch just better right now. Vision strikers are getting backhanded right now. F1! It tells you what the abilities do! Escaping it, the inevitable strikes and buzz finds vanity. Marco finds Zeta, and it's all looking one sided. What are you guys doing? There can only be one going forward now. The group of death, as it was hailed, is going to claim another victim. Map one, I think, sent a bit of a shockwave through any fans out there going, wait, what is going on? Map two, reassurance for Vision Striker fans out there hoping to see more of them. And map three, we go somewhat into the unknown. Time is of a factor and leave, says no. It's 12 for Cloud9. Low, 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 low. I'm low. Wait, close, close. close. Okay. Nice! Oh, shit! Yeah. Number one, baby! Real <laughs> <laughs> Yes, so we're joined here by Zeta, but we had to get a translator for him just in case. I was I was told that Vandy's actually fluent in Korean, so he's going to be stepping in today. Absolutely nothing could possibly go wrong with that. I'm going to start by asking you guys from LCQ all the way to playoffs here at Champions. Did you expect that you would be, first of all, the first NA team going through, but that you would outperform Sentinels at this event? Oh, first of all, we're here to 1년 동안 엄청 열심히 준비했기 때문에 이제 앤서니가 저희 팀에 베니티가 들어오고 나서 저희가 엄청 열심히 이제 연습했고 체계나 이제 이런 세부적인 이제 디테일 같은 것도 채우면서 피수 최대 안 하면서 저희끼리 잠을 안 하려고 엄청 노력해가지고 여기까지 좋은 결과 얻어가지고 왔습니다. 
Uh, so pretty much, he said, as soon as I joined, we noticed a pretty instant improvement in our practice, and we were destroying every team in NA in scrims. Honestly, like, I think the only teams we would lose to in America were like two or three teams in practice, at least. Uh, so it's kind of expected. I mean, Sentinels doesn't practice. It's not really a secret to anyone. You know, it's, it's funny because uh, I did a podcast with Sadie. He was never that toxic. Something must have brought it out of him here on the stage. I love that. I love that. Well, I want to talk a little bit about the players. James, this is a good enough caption. Where did Hoon go? What, what is it? No, you're not. You did your Just a regular. Oh, yeah, yeah. I like it. <laughs> Play Vision Strikers went 2 1, lost split. Kind of went terrible, yeah, honestly. We won, and it just doesn't feel like a win, and we made playoffs. Not yet. Until we win finals, it's going to feel great. We play against Liquid today. Hope our results would be the same like our spring. <laughs> because we own them. <laughs> Does he realize he has time? This is going to be absolutely crazy. A scream can't get there in, in time here. It's well planted for him. There's the poison off to start applying the pressure. Taps it. Scream's gonna have to shoot in. He's gonna oh, fall into the catch and moving forwards. What a bait coming out of Mitch. Oh, oh come on, baby. Amazing stuff there from Liquid, making it truly impossible. Uh, overall, pretty happy with the event. I mean, it was two of our teammates' first time on LAN. It's Mitch and his first time being back at a LAN in like probably close to two years. So, I mean, it sucks to lose, but uh, I'm pretty happy with the result and how we played throughout the entire event. Together on stage for the first time, our team did pretty well. I, you know, Vanity is like a big showman and was yelling, and I was yelling too. Like, I love the energy. Uh, I do think, though, we had a few matches here and there where we got a little bit. Uh, I guess you could say nervous or something. Like I could notice a little thing and we kind of changed our prep to shore that up. I think the best thing about LAN is just like the energy is just way different than playing online. Like even if you're together in like a boot camp, it's not like the same thing as like just how much like the atmosphere is different in the LAN environment. So, I mean, something hopefully we can get back to next year and uh, hopefully COVID can, we can figure this, this issue out in the world and get back to like normal LAN events with crowds and stuff. That'd be really cool because I've never played in, I've only played in front of one crowd and it was really, really cool. The main thing like I feel like that differentiates from a team that's like newer to a team that's older is um, discipline and like learning from mistakes, obviously. So like when you have less time together, you have less scenarios that you've played through and less like solutions to those um, scenarios if they do happen again. So like, you know, maybe in like even two more months, uh, we could look a lot better just because we've played so many more, you know, rounds of Valorant. I'm super proud of our players. Like they worked hard all year. Uh, one of the main things I was saying during every day of practice to kind of keep the mood light was that there's no pressure in this tournament. Like this tournament is just a celebration of the effort we've put in all year. Like one day of prep during the middle of the tournament isn't gonna like make or break us, so to speak. So just enjoy the moment and, and kind of just like cash in on everything you've done all year. The overall atmosphere of the team is very fun. Uh, I don't have to, uh, ins I don't have to like convince people to wanna get better. All of my players wanna get better all the time. So that's really nice for me because I can just help them get better, right? Um, so we're always having fun. I guess one thing is that like, you know, sometimes we're a little bit trolly in scrims and other teams will take offense to that, but our guys are, aren't doing it to offend people. They're just doing it because they're having fun. So that's one thing to clear up. Let's take Ready? Are <laughs> you ready? Hey! What the fuck are you Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Anthony. Okay. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Damn.
motherfucker, you can't sing. Right. No, <laughs> no <laughs> rhythm, no nothing, bro. That's <laughs> <laughs> crazy. Like, you know what? You have to be an English. Because I joined the Cloud9, I've never felt the kind of feeling that's surrounded by like really great players and a great st step and then supporting by a like organic actual or like great organization before. So it's that's why it feels like really uh, motivated even be then even the before. So yeah, it feels really good. Proud like that I'm part of like Cloud9. So I just like only have to like move forward and then we will be in the next year and then we will be a really great team. Thank you guys for all the support. It really means the world to me. Like I switched to this game about, I think it's about exactly a year at this point, and I've accomplished more than I thought I was going to be capable of at this point in my career, so thank you guys for everything. It really means a lot.